Good morning, I'm meteorologist Ted Schmidt. I'm here in the uh, KTTC and Fox 47 studios here on this Tuesday morning. A uh, little weather cast here, but also a microphone check because we had some issues last week with our microphone. I'm trying to see if this works, so let me know if you can't hear anything. Or, you know, make, a, make a note of that uh, so I can find out because um, otherwise I have to figure out what's going on with it and try to play engineer, which is not usually a, a, ends in that's something that ends well for the say I probably have to get some help on the on the, the technical aspects of this but anyway hopefully it's working and I hope you're out, you're having a great day because the weather today is phenomenal we woke up with sub freezing temperatures we got down to 31 this morning in Rochester it's already 48 here just a couple of minutes after uh, 10 o'clock very light winds that's something that's gonna be true of the entire day tons of sunshine light winds and warmer weather than recent days. And the good thing is it, it's going to feel warmer because of the lack of wind. Yesterday we got into the 50s, but we had those 16, 17 mile per hour winds that were with us pretty much all afternoon. And it uh, didn't feel so great out there. I mean, we were wearing you know jackets and, and things like that walking around. Today, maybe a sweater. It's not not exactly going to be going to be bright and uh, you know May like with those temperatures, but it'll be at least a little warmer and uh, without as much wind feeling a little better. Uh, but again, I'm a meteorologist Ted Schmidt talking about uh, today's sunshine and the prospect of 70s coming up here by the end of the week. 48 right now in Rochester, it's 50 in Charles City, Iowa. Uh, it feels like 45, just enough of a breeze out there to have a wind chill impact, but not by, not much. Six mile per hour wind, air pressure is steady. Uh, day planner, tons of sunshine all the way until sunset. 57, the high temperature later on. Sunset, 826. Uh, satellite radar, pretty quiet right now. We look at uh, some of the showers coming in from the west. There's some very light rain moving across the plains. That will move in tomorrow. Maybe a brief, brief shower first thing in the morning. And then by this time tomorrow, by, or really by early afternoon, we'll have more widespread rain and perhaps just a, a rumble of thunder or two. But at this point, I'm not thinking... Uh, a huge amount of rain and not not consistent all day rain, but there will be some scattered showers, especially tomorrow afternoon. 40, uh, 57 the high today though, with sunshine. Uh, clouds thickening tonight, keeping temperatures from getting anywhere close to where they've been the last four or five nights. Uh, overnight lows around 40, uh, maybe 41 degrees. So mild sunshine today, midweek rain tomorrow and both uh, tomorrow and Thursday, future rain chances. Weekend does look uh, actually a little warmer, some uh, high pressure and some sunshine, but here's that high moving on to the east. Winds turn more to the southeast tonight. Clouds gathering, temperatures low 40s. Tomorrow, brief shower early. That is around 7 o'clock in the morning on Futurecast. When they go into the afternoon, we start seeing more and more of those showers moving through. Maybe enough instability for a rumble of thunder, just a slight chance of that, and rain through tomorrow night. By Thursday morning, most of the rain is out of here. We may have a brief shower beyond that for the mid part of the day. Otherwise, uh, occasional sunshine. A little less wind on Thursday. Tomorrow looks like a breezy day, and that's how we warm up to around 60 with the southeast winds on the gusty side. But today, look for uh, some sun, some light winds, 57 Rochester, close to 60 in Mesa City, right around 60 in La Crosse. Northwest winds only 5 to 10 miles per hour. 40 tonight, increasing cloud cover late in the night, a light southeast breeze. And tomorrow, breezy winds at uh, times 30 miles per hour out of the southeast, especially in the early afternoon. 60 the high, some showers, perhaps an afternoon rumble of thunder. Seven-day forecast, a couple of showers Thursday, especially early. Slight chance of a brief shower on Saturday. Otherwise, the weekend looking bright and pleasant, low 70s. 76 on Monday. And yes, you see that warming trend. It does look like that may carry us into the 80s by the middle of next week. So we have that to look forward to. If you're thinking, you know, it's been chilly for a while, you want something a little on the other end of the spectrum, how about something abnormally warm? For instance, it does look like we're going to see that maybe three or four days next week, some abnormally warm, almost June-like temperatures for that uh, big uh, week leading up to Memorial Day. That'll be next week, of course. In the meantime, have a great day. Enjoy the sun. I'll see you back here tomorrow.